how to install face recognition library in Jupyter Notebook the easiest way. In this video, we'll also understand how can you install any library in Jupyter Notebook. Please watch till the end. Hi, my name is Amit. Welcome to my channel. So do we have a separate terminal window as like we have in PyCharm to install any library using pip command? Actually, we don't need any uh, separate terminal window in Jupyter Notebook because you could install your any library from the cell itself. Let's jump on to Jupyter Notebook and let me show you how can we install any library and uh, we'll also be installing face recognition library. To start with Jupyter Notebook, you must have installed uh, Jupyter Notebook, right? So Jupyter Notebook, uh, I've uh, just by clicking here, it is going to start your Jupyter Notebook. So uh, the server, local server. So here uh, is my uh, Jupyter server. Now I'm going to uh, start the Jupyter no new notebook and uh, we'll do installations from there. So for new, you have this option called uh, new and which notebook do you want to start with? Because uh, Jupyter supports multiple uh, coding languages. So here we have Python. So I'm going to start with Python 3. Yes, yeah, so we have this uh, cell and uh, we are now going to install a few of, few of the libraries and uh, definitely this uh, face recognition library. So first of all, we need to install uh, OpenCV library. So I'm going to install OpenCV library. So here is this command. Uh, this uh, link is in the description box below. So you can check that out as well. So here I'm going to just copy this and uh, we'll, we'll paste it here. But uh, this is this will not work because uh, we need to give a special character here that is uh, exclamation mark so with exclamation mark it treats whatever is in front as a command right so here I'm going to install this so it takes some some time but you could see there uh, it has downloaded the package and it has uh, installed me uh, this library so uh, let's check if uh, we have installed uh, OpenCV library and shortly we'll also install face recognition library so import import CV2 and let's see if it works yeah so it didn't show us any error so that means this is working Jupyter notebook is being installed by uh, anaconda software so we need to find out where that where this uh, python is located so <clears throat> we are going to uh, understand it with this command so here i have this command <coughs> that is percentage percentage command so if you write percentage percentage command so further whatever you write it is going to treat it as a terminal command so uh, we have this command called uh, uh, where python uh, we need to un understand where is it located first of all and and we'll also need to find out what version we have of uh, of this python so here uh, just the percentage percentage command and uh, where where python is my terminal command right so i'm going to run this yeah, so I could see that there are uh, two, three uh, instances where uh, it has got Python. So this is uh, my default location where I have already installed Python by my own. And here uh, is this um, where Anaconda has installed this by this particular Python. So Jupyter Notebook is going to use this uh, this particular version, right? Uh, this particular uh, interpreter from from this location. So we need to understand whether my library, whenever it installs, it get installed into this particular location and not at this point, right? So that's what we need to make sure. So uh, <clears throat> uh, how can we make sure uh, with that is, uh, as we have seen that uh, here is this location. So you can go on to that particular location and check whether uh, your library is installed uh, at this location or not. So let's go on to that location. So here I have my uh, uh, Anaconda uh, location where where is it installed. So I'll go on to the slib and all of the packages that we install with peep command gets installed into uh, the site packages. So let me let me just check whether we have uh, OpenCV. Yeah, so we have uh, we have seen that we have installed uh, this uh, OpenCV underscore Python uh, library and it is there in this location. So that means it is actually uh, installing our um, libraries into this particular uh, location, right? So do we have direct command to install uh, uh, face recognition library? Yes. So here is this command. So I'm just going to copy this and let's come on to here and I'm going to do is percentage 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 CMD CMD and 
this is my command so let's run this command it will take take some time yes so uh, we have got error uh, installing uh, from this command so which means we need to install um, uh, it step by step right so here is this error we have uh, error for cmake and for dbuild library dlib library right so we are going to now install separately this uh, dlib library and cmake library okay so here i have command to install cmake library so let's get going and run yes so cmake library uh, has installed successfully so uh, let's uh, let's install now dlib library and to install dlib library we have uh, uh, <clears throat> i've already created a video i'm going to give you uh, the link in the description box below uh, if you are uh, not installing it with jupiter right uh, and here in this video we are going to understand how can we install this in jupiter we have this dlib library, library packages uh, pre-built packages wheel packages and uh, again you will find the link in the description box to download these packages so here we have uh, different packages uh, for the different versions of the python so we need to also understand what what python version do i have uh, in the jupyter notebook so how can we find that as uh, we need, we have this command called python version okay python hyphen hyphen version so i'm going to use this command so with this command i'm going to get what python version i'm using within this uh, python jupyter uh, jupyter notebook right so here i have uh, yeah so we are actually using this uh, python 3.8.5 right so uh, so do we have this 3.8 yes 3.8 version uh, we have this in this package so we are going to now install this particular one right so to install uh, we have this command called uh, pip install and we need to provide the complete path where this is located so this is going to my going to be my complete path so i'm just copy this and uh, let's put it into our command so here i have uh, pip install and this is my entire location now further we need to select which particular version do you, do we need to install so here i'm going and here i select so let's select the complete file name with extension and let's come here and i'm going to now paste it here so we have this uh, this at this location this file need to be installed so it is going to install me uh, this particular package right so let's hit run and wait until it finishes the command as i have just copied it from a uh, different uh, location this character is somewhat uh, unknown to it so i'm going to do uh, just delete this and uh, give it a proper character so here you should remember that your command should look like this right so if you are copying it from at some different location so you should be uh, make sure that it it look like this so now let's run this and uh, let's let it get installed right so we have successfully installed our dlib library so we are good to go with our face recognition command so here i am just copying it again now it should install my required library right so we have seen that uh, we could now uh, successfully install our face recognition library in python uh, jupyter notebook you will find a link in the description box to download these dlib packages there are also links uh, to install uh, these packages so you can check that out if you are not using jupyter notebook and you want to install face recognition library in for example pycharm so here is the link for you to uh, check that uh, check how can you install face recognition library in uh, pycharm if you like this video give it a thumbs up uh, this motivates me and for more such videos subscribe to my channel bye bye see you in the next one